Welcome to the Mechanic Desk Help Videos. In this tutorial, we will show you how to set up and use job types as a template to streamline the process of creating new jobs. Log into the website and within the job section, click on the tab for job types. On the left, you will see a list of job types to select from and configure according to your requirements and you can create a new job type by clicking on the available link. To modify a job type, for example major service, click on the link to reveal the current configuration of job details, check sheet items and costs for that job type. Click inside the details section to display fields for the job type name, description and number of days to the next service. Edit any of the fields to suit your needs. For example, if you prefer a cycle of three months before a major service is due, change the number to 90. Click Save when you are done. In the Check Sheet region, click on the Add New Work link to set up a list of tasks associated with the job type you are configuring. In this case, Engine, Oil and Brakes. In the Costs section, click on the Add Item Stock link to include any standard labour or other costs associated with the job type. The template now reflects the various alterations we have made and can now be used to quickly set up new jobs. Click on the Current Jobs tab, then click on the New Job button to open a fresh job sheet. Enter the customer and vehicle details. In this example, we will use an existing customer. Then scroll down to the job section. Click on the pop-up menu for job type to select major service. Then click on the save button to add the new job. Note that the job sheet contains the check sheet and invoice items that we set up in the template earlier. Also, once the job is completed and we click on the Finish button, the next service field is automatically set to 90 days, as determined by our revised template. 